Hi, my name is Nick Anderson, and today I'm going to show you how to record an audio track using an interface with your computer in Logic Pro X. Let's get started. All right, so first thing you're going to want to do is obviously open Logic Pro X. We'll click Logic Pro in the toolbar up here. We'll go to Preferences and then Audio. I've got a Scarlett 2i2 plugged in uh, for my audio interface today. Whatever audio interface you have, you'll want to use these same directions for that. Um, then you'll click here, you got audio, we're going to go output device, and then Scarlett 2i2 USB, that's the one I'm using, so that's the one I select. Um, I'm going to leave mine in multi-output multi device actually though, because that's what I'm using to do this, the streaming here. But yours, you would click on whatever the interface you're using is. On input device, same thing, you're going to want to select that interface. Now that your interface is selected, you can do the fun part. You're going to go to track, new tracks, audio, and then here's the cool thing. Your computer will automatically recognize the different inputs that you have on the interface that you selected. My interface is a Scarlett Focusrite 2i2, um, so it has two inputs. So when I click on audio input, you'll see I can choose input one, input two, inputs one and two. I'm just going to choose input one because I just have my microphone plugged into input one. Then you're going to click create, and then you can kind of hear that this microphone is ready to go in there. Yours might not have this eye highlighted right away. That's input monitoring. You can click that, and then you'll be able to hear in your headphones what's coming through the microphone. And then you can start to add different things to that microphone, and you're ready to record. The next thing you want to do is just hit that record button. Recording, recording. And then you'll see, we just recorded. Recording, recording. It's as easy as that. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the description below. I highly recommend getting a Focusrite Scarlett 2i2. It's a fantastic interface to use. I've had this one for, I think, over eight years, and it's worked fantastic for me. I've never had any problems with it, and I have used it a lot. All right, if you like this video, make sure you subscribe. We've got lots of Logic Pro X tips, tutorials, and presets for you on this channel. My name is Nick Anderson. Until next time, rock on.